How you doing, boys? Going, How's things? What's the story behind this? I don't know. We are back, guys. We're at the flea market. It's a Sunday morning. I'm so excited for today. Got so many vendors. Uh, we're going to go to Frockerami today as well. Uh, men's and women's fashion wear. That's a little later in the day, but we've got a bunch of vendors here at the car boot sales to so have a look at, and I'm ready to buy. So let's do it. They're all different price. Yeah, I mean these will be like 40. 40. And everything else basically would be about 20 20 20 dollar mark. Nike's up there? Uh what well, they'll be 40, yeah. They'll be 40. Yeah. Yeah. Could I do one twice? <laughs> yeah, they're in pretty good condition, yeah. aren't they? No, that's cool. They're good shoes. The climate cools are sick. Yeah, yeah. I haven't seen them in ages. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, unreal. Ah, uh, thanks guys, good luck today. Thank you. Morning guys. How you doing? Good, how are you doing? Not bad. We're 30 for the dogs. Do you know? The grey ones beside. Do you know what size? I Not sure. Them out of my sister's cupboard. Oh, did you? That's all good. Appreciate it though. They're oh, great no shoes. At all. Someone's buying them. Yep, definitely. All good. Have a great day. You too. Yeah. I'm really good. How are you? Yeah, getting there. You got some great little items here. Yeah, I like them. Yeah. Ah, the 500 Dragons. Beauty. So cool. Yeah, it is. You got a big collection at home, do you? Or? No, it's pretty much it. That's it, is it? Yeah. Cleaning it out? Yeah, no. I never really got into it. <laughs> oh, really? Well, I bought one and then two, and I don't know. They seem to multiply all of a sudden. Yeah, they do with the pops, yeah, don't they? they do. I got the giant one. I thought, oh, you beauty. I made oh, it. Oh, wow. Yeah, but... Uh, and that, they're that, too big for the shelves, one of the kids told me. And you know, he's absolutely right, that kid was. It is too big for the shelf. And I bought it one, day one. Talk to me about this jersey. It's signed, uh, it's certified Porter Junior, that's, number one. That's pretty cool. Home Guernsey winners. Yeah, absolutely one, it is. One last weekend. They did win last weekend. Correct. Um, how much on it? Um, I'll take 200. Is it 200? Yeah, do you know what it's worth? Uh, it's worth about four or five. Is it really? Yeah. Especially the white colour, most of them are the blue or the different nuggets. Are you able to hold it hold yeah, it out? Certainly. That's a big look at that. Oh yeah, that's cool. Yeah, he played a blinder too. Yeah he did. Yeah he did. I was pretty impressed when they won. I thought, yo, that makes that uh, Yeah, right. Good. Nah, that's epic. If it's still here, come and see me. I, I will, because I'm definitely interested. Yeah, I'm not I'm not a big basketball-y fan. No. Nah. No, and it's not one I could wear or anything, you know, so... It's that's definitely... right. No, very cool item. Yeah. That's why we come down to the flea market, hey? Yeah, that's right. Just that's cool right. things. Yeah. How much on the hats? Oh, berries, 4X1, probably... Oh, sorry, that. Yep. I'll do that. Hopefully you get 10 grand in there. Absolutely. There's a lot too, yeah? No, I love these sort of 4X hats. Five panel too, a really cool that's, style. Yeah, that's a, yeah, that's right. Definitely an older version. Absolutely. Yeah. Very, very cool. Thank Appreciate you so much. It. Thank you, mate. Appreciate it. All right, see ya. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ah, some cool Nikes. Hey, how are you? Fun? Oh, cool Nikes. Yeah, they're, they're brand new. Jeez, they look like it. 50 bucks. 50 bucks? Yeah, my daughter has an online store, but she, um, they're just extras. They're small there, she's got some different, different ones there. Oh, wow. What do you mean, extras? They're really good shoes. Yes, they are. <laughs> what, um, what size are they? Uh, on the box, 11 men's. 11, oh, it's on 12. Yeah, right. You never see dunks at the flea market. <laughs> you're not meant to either. Yo. No, you're not meant to. These sorts of things shouldn't be here. They are nice. It's such a shame they don't fit. She got more, does she? No. She's had them at the side. Ah. Oh, they are. Yeah, I saw, I saw a blind on the store at the moment. Gotcha. On eBay? No, I just 
just do like Instagram and stuff like that as well as Facebook. So I pretty much just run my business through that. What's your Insta? Kick on exclusive. Kick on exclusive. Yeah. Go I've um I've got a YouTube channel as well. Oh, do you? So yeah, I'll, nice. I'll give you a plug. Yeah. Push a few people across. Oh, that cool. Yeah. They're nice. Hey man, how are you? Hey man, how things? That's the way. How much on these ones? 50. Alright, well, I'll do those. Is it 50? Are they different pricing or? No, no, adults 50 and the little kids. It's sick. Clear it out. I hear. A good pair. I reckon yeah. you should take those. <laughs> they are a nice shoe if they, they fit are. you. Yeah. Yeah, I'd, I'd do that. They're just not. I have to say, they're just. You know, some shoes are really comfortable on you. Yeah. And they're just not the most comfortable. They're more. Uh, this is what they look like, and I suffer through the fact that they're a bit not so fitted to my foot. <clears throat> Jeez. But. Yeah, I think you should go ahead and <laughs> go ahead and grab them. All right, guys, we'll do two for a hundred, eh? I can't believe I just found three pairs of dunks at the flea market. Unbelievable. Well, the Dragon Ball Z games are always. Yeah. Well, that, that's me. I'm 32, so Dragon Ball Z is. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. And then you got 55 on that as well. And that's for all the... Well... Yeah, I'm definitely interested in... Uh, Dragon Ball Z. I don't know what we're looking at here, but I'm good to go. Even 100, Matt. Okay, no stress at all. I'll take that. 100 bucks. Yeah, bag would be great. Thank you. How you doing, guys? Good, good. How are you? Oh, one of the great days at the flea market. <laughs> I've You're got, buying heaps, have you? I'm buying heaps. <laughs> I like the look of this. That's very, that's unopened, brand new. Yep. And on eBay, it's going for about 100, 100 bucks on eBay. About 100 on eBay? Yeah. Yeah. We got there for 50. 50 bucks? Well, that's mm. pretty decent. Mm. Yeah, nice. And it's is it new sealed or is it just... Uh, Absolutely it's... new New sealed, isn't it? No, not sealed. Ah, not sealed. Not sealed. Okay. That's all right. I don't think there's ever been sealed in that box. Yeah, that's a box. Okay. Yeah, of course, of course. No, very, very good. It's a great show. Yeah. Have you watched it? No. no. We haven't. Well, it's that's given what I have watched. Yeah. As a gift, I never opened. So. Well, yeah. I'll keep having a look around, but I'll have a think sure. about it, though, guys. Okay, no worries. Appreciate that. No how you doing, boys? How you going, bro? How's things? That's the way. Condition is just so important. Very. Ten bucks. It's just the condition. That's the only thing. Otherwise, I'd grab them. Very cool. What's the story behind this? I don't know anything about it. You know nothing about it? No. You just stumbled across it, eh? Oh, I've given it, yeah. Yeah, wow. Skeleton Warriors. G30? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it.
Thank you so much. Awesome. Thanks. Thank Appreciate it. Much. Unreal. Like and subscribe. He's in. Guys, hit the subscribe button right now. I was just saying, how sharp is Maddie looking today? Got the haircut. Trimmed up. Got the jacket on, the RVCA. Fuckable, Woo! Fuckable accountant. Here we are. <laughs> oh, mate. Have you bought anything yet? Yes. What have you got? Ooh. Oh, that's nice. SP hat. Just going to clean that up. Yeah, for you or to sell? That's for me. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, the other day I was in the salvos. Yeah. What Found is it? Gold. Gold? Real gold. Oh, that's wow. 9 carat, 18 carat, 9 carat. And you get a hold on? or? No, 300 bucks worth of gold. Is 22 really? bucks. $22? Yeah. Jeez, that's every day. Not bad, eh? That's unreal. Oh, it just feels insane down here today. There's just so much good stuff. Not a lot of, not a lot of buyers. Too no. Too cold for the buyers. Too cold for the buyers. Yeah. Except for you and me, my friend. Hey, we're in there. <laughs> but, uh, oh, that's nice. Oh, that's really nice. Parramatta. Embroidered. Jax would be all over that, dude. We should buy it for him. Yeah, let's do it. A couple of hours ago. These are nice. Look at these. Yeah, yeah I want 50 or something for that. 50 on these? Yeah. There's three of them. Three of them in there? Yeah. Yeah, well, one's wrapped up in something else. Details. 1991 Phantom Mug. Yeah, they're good. They yeah, are amazing. You look online, they're probably 70 or so, are not they? 70 but each, are they? You check us anyhow. Yeah. That's a very cool find. Yeah. Oh, mate. What did you what did you get the dunks for? Oh mate, I'll oh, show yeah. you. Thanks mate, you have a good one, eh? I might have to pop back, eh? <laughs> I like the way you sell. Oh, he's found something. Yeah, mate, cheap to grab, mate. What have you found? Just some, some Adidas, mate. Oh, you got some shoes? Three bucks, mate. Love that. Can't say no to three bucks. You got a Raiders hat in there? Yeah, mate. Ah, cool. well, Unreal. Man. Oh, you've been going nuts on the Nikes, eh? I went nuts on the Nikes. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to buy a pair now, as we You should, mate, because they're not going to last very long no, over there. I've got to hold a pair for me so I don't lose them. Go do it. Go do it. It's a rare day to find a pair of dunks at the fleet. It is. Hello, guys. Oh, goodness me, you've been shopping. Oh, I've been very busy today. Yeah. How have you guys been going? Well, we've just got breakfast in. Well, breakfast is a good thing. Yeah, that's a good start. $2, please buy it. $2? Mm -hmm. I'll buy that for $2. The man comes with bags. That's all he comes with. There's plenty of bags here today. Thank you, guys. Yeah, right. What time did you get here this morning? Uh, about 6.30. It's not too bad, actually. Yeah. Does the G-Shock work at all, do you know? Uh, they all need batteries. Just need batteries, yeah. Yeah, this one needs a... Um, Oh yeah, band. little little yeah. band on it. Yeah, they're pretty. These G-Shocks are pretty good though. Yeah, I've had. Yeah. You got one yourself? That was my first one when I was twelve. I'm twenty-one now. Oh man. really? So yeah, they, wow. they last a long time. They do, man. Yeah, stand the test. Same with the RM Williams stuff too. Yeah, <laughs> that holds on forever. Yeah. Nah, very cool. How you been? Jeez, you got the, you guys got the best store here. Good. Absolutely. It's just everything you'd want. <laughs> How's it all been going? It's been a little bit since I last seen you guys. Yeah, it's been a while. I had a break. Had a break, did you? And are these all listed, are they? Or No, these are all just my um, like common ones. All the commons? Yeah. I just can't stop buying these things, though. Yeah, I know. I was addicted to them. That's why I've got so many. And they do sell. Yeah. They turn over pretty good. Yeah. Uh, is that the full set of um, Academia? Yeah. There's so many now that it's probably not the full set. Nah. Because um, you got, you got quite a few. Yeah, it's a fair few. Yeah. It's always easier to sell in sets. Yeah. Oh, you got a Simpsons one. Which one's that one? Oh, yeah. These would all be like 2025, wouldn't they? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, he had to be all right. You never know. No, you never know. Oh, oh. look who it is. <laughs> Look who it is. This is my sister. Oh. <laughs> Matt, Matt, this is Elle. Elle. Nice to meet you. Matt, 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 Matt. You're in the vlog. Yeah. You're in the vlog. Uh, what, are you, what are you up to? Have you bought anything? No, I literally just crossed in. I'm here for Procorama. Yeah, well, it starts in half an hour, so we're going to go across in a second. I'm going to get a coffee soon, I think. Yeah, great. Um, you can hold the camera for me then. I can be cameraman. Ooh. Look at these. 
These are pretty cool too. Yeah. What's the story behind these? Oh, they're epic. Uh, they were all out of the one movie. Yeah, wow. And I sold it. I'm selling it as a set. Everybody wants to buy individual. I said, no. No, I'd hold on to it as a set. Yeah, 75 bucks. 75. Some, see, some of these are still as new. Yeah, they were actually tied in, aren't they? Yeah. Do you know what year it is? Not sure. Not sure. Maybe on the bottom. Oh, there you go. It's a bit now, yeah? It doesn't, doesn't have a year. Uh, which is unusual. It is unusual, yeah. yeah. Oh, very cool, though. Comic books are good too. Yeah, once again, the ones that I've got. 60 bucks on that, is it? Is it? First appearance in oh. Carnage. Oh, we'll clean his castle before he became Carnage. That is so cool. Wow. So, yeah, there's a couple of, a couple of key issues. The rest of them are like some of like, that's the second appearance of Deadpool. Yep. Yeah. yeah the, I've learned all about that, the first appearances. Yeah, yeah, well, the key issues are where the money's up. Mm. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Coldplay. How cool, eh? Bells, Bells. Ah, oh, I see they see. Bells, Bells. Killing Heidi. Yeah. Right. That's pretty cool. They're all going to be a bit too small for these. <laughs> yeah, small sizes, eh? Hey? Pink Floyd. So that there. Yeah. Um, just a Thailand. Fake. Yeah, knock off. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of them are kind of like, as cool as they are. Well, Cotton On do a lot of this sort of shit too. That, that's right. That one. Small size. Mm. Corn though, that's kind of cool. This is sweet. Yeah, I like that with the long sleeve. How cool is that? That might on? be. That's very cool. Yeah. And then this one. Embroidered. Oh, Harley. Harley. Harley goes well. Harley embroidered. Oh. Genuine. He's not bad. That's a good one. What size? 4XL. That'd be perfect. How much on that one? 50. 50? Yeah, rightly so. It's a ripper. I might have to leave him though, but he'll go. Yeah, nah, all good. This is everything, and that's it. Oh, that's sweet. So I don't, I don't know. Do you know much about it? No. That's it, but it's it's like 95. Yeah, take it into take it into the Toy Boys store. Take it in and get them to yeah. Let's have a look at it. Yeah. But that'd be that'd be sealed packets in there, wouldn't they? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Just such a gnarly find, eh? Yeah. It's weird. And then, like you'd know this better than anyone. Yeah, sweet. Three hundred dollars. Uh, two hundred dollar yeah. game. Yeah. Um, so yeah, a bunch of games. We've got that for two dollars. Got that for uh, five dollars. Yeah. And then these were the dunks. So there's those. Um, these are your bags. Oh man, she, she's actually got an online store. Ah, uh, okay. So I wasn't concerned about authentication or yeah, anything. Yeah. Um, that's yeah, golden sweet. rods. Yeah. And then these were the sickest shoes. I wish they were my size. Yeah, uh, sweet. For another fifty. So. I just, fifty. That's good. One hundred and fifty for three. Yeah. Uh, and then yeah, all the rest. All right, we're just going to grab a coffee and then we're going to go and do this Frockorama. We've got men's and women's fashion wear. It's a quarterly sale. This only happens four times a year. Um, we've obviously done pretty well on the market, but now we're going to go, well, yeah, I've done very well. Uh, but now we're going to go into this and hopefully just keep buying. Have a good one. Thank you. You got some good stuff. I know. This is amazing. I know. <laughs> so good. I know. <laughs> it's in the video. I'm going to film it. How's your market there? 82 Streetwear. Give them a follow. Instagram or what? Instagram. Instagram. Ukulele Sunsets. That's awesome. Um, yeah, I got dunks. I got three pairs of dunks. I left them in the car. That's cool too. Yeah. That's what we just found at the flea market, guys. We've got the golden rods. 250 bucks and we paid $50. So we should be able to get similar money to that. About 250 Pretty crazy. 
That's something you want to be finding, guys. Mambo loud. Look at these. Amazing. They could be worth some crazy money. Look at that. $200 for a Mambo loud. If you can find these in op shops, my goodness, you'll be making some money. 200 bucks on that one there. That one's nice. There is a vendor booth here that I know very well, and that is um, Oz Treasure Hunters, Jackson and Amanda. They're in today. They've got a booth and they're selling. So I'm going to go and check out their stall and just see how it's going for them. Here they are coming. Jump in, Amanda. Jump in, Amanda. Hey, dude. How you doing? Good, Dad. How are you? I'm well. I'm well. Just, it's just been over, overwhelming, all of these cool items. Yeah. You've yeah. got a mad setup in here, too. Yeah, no, we've got like the... I'm, I'm next to my mate Finley, so we can sort of just open Where, this which up. Which one's Finley? Finley, rather. Finley, we haven't met, bro. How are you? Good, how are you? Nice to meet you. So this is your setup too, hey? Yeah, this is mine, all this. So. Wow, man. Geez, you boys have both got some good stuff. That's crazy. Yeah. How's it been this morning? Not bad. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, look at the back. 90-90, Ren and Stimpy. Wow. That's elite. Hey, Matt. Follow me for the real good stuff, but... <laughs> we need... Where's your business cards? I don't have a business card, but... We've got the... Come on, we've got a map. I do like that. We've got the big sign in the back there. Have a look we've at the sign. One. Have a look at the sign. Picture. Dude, it's very cool. Yeah, I know, it's just... Um, say the name of the Instagram. So it's unique. It's Y-O-U and then the rest of the... Unreal, mate. We'll get him to give you a follow. Over there. That's perfect. Thank you very much. <laughs> now you got some awesome stuff, mate. Yeah, it's been great. It's been all um, basically just from op shops, from like just talking to people over and over again. And then, That's it. So you've yeah. just built the connection, not through any wholesale, like from the States or anything? No. So you... I, barely anything you'll see here is wholesale. Most of it's all Facebook. People will like see that I'm a seller and then... Get in touch. Yeah, bring out more stuff when I go see them about one piece and then that's how I got two of the Mambos. Yeah, the Mambos are amazing. Yeah. Um, that's what it's all about, just connections, isn't it? Yeah, it's way easier when you just talk to people. Like yesterday I went to... One up in Brizzy, and they just gave me all their like wholesale sacks they'd gotten and just stuff through. So, made amazing, amazing. Third door vintage. Yeah. How long have you guys been doing it? Um, six months. Six months? Six months, like doing markets and stuff. That's uh, awesome. I've been kind of selling on and off for years. You're on eBay? Uh, I've tried eBay, but it's a bit too much work. A bit too much. Yeah, it is a lot of work. I work full time, so I do this on the side. This is just, uh, yep. Well, you must know then I love my hats. I know you love your hats. I do yeah. love my hats. And you've got a couple of good ones. Yeah. The sports ones are good, but I reckon you'd get better prices for them on eBay. I think so. Yeah. Definitely. I think so too. Um, so, all right, well, let's do a deal then, hey? Yeah. We'll do roosters, eagles, dockers. Um, oh, two in a bag. I think the boys haven't put them out. Oh, they're all out? Yeah, yeah there's yeah, a couple yeah, here. You got the bunny? I, know I, you like your stuff. I love my budding stuff. stuff. This Brisbane Bullets hat's kind of cool too. Um, that's a Foot Locker hat, isn't it? Yes. That's sweet as well. Um, what's that? Yeah. Outlaws. That Indy car hat as well is kind of cool. All right, so we got we got four. Four, yep. What do you reckon? Yeah. I'll do one free with a thirty for the four. I'm happy with that. Yeah, Let's sweet. do it. Thanks. All right, guys. I was talking to Rob earlier at the flea market, and he said to take these into the toy box guy here at uh, the Crow Market. So I'm actually going to go in to try and get a bit of an intel on this. So I want to see what it's worth, what it could be, and what potentially he might be willing to pay for it as well, because we might be able to do a quick flip here at the markets. So the big red shed, it's just down here, and we'll go and check it out and see what this thing's worth. How you doing, mate? I wanted to see if you knew much about this. Skeleton Warriors, yeah. Skeleton Warrior yeah. Flare Castle. Well, my the partner does. He likes them. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm making a YouTube video, and I found this at the flea market. Yeah. Um, out the back in the car boots. Yeah. And I was curious to get an evaluation or even uh, a... Probably better off coming next week if you are. Oh, really? Yeah, the owner's more of a... Oh, he's not here? No, he's not. Ah, he's damn. Saying, sorry, dude. Okay, no stress. All, All right. good. Appreciate it, man. 
So unfortunately, the toy box guy was unable to uh, give me any information um, on those FLIR cards. So I'm gonna have to do some research back home. Um, I've obviously got a lot of items to take you through and the value of all of them as well from today. It has been an amazing time at the flea market. It's so good to be back. And I think from now on, considering the flea markets, are, uh, sorry, the thrift stores are so overpriced and really not that great of quality, what we saw here today out at the flea market just makes you want to come back each and every Sunday. So um, very lucky to have it so close to home and have the quality so high. So yeah, let's get back home. We'll go through all of these items and I'll show you what I paid and obviously how much I think I can make on it. I think it was arguably my best ever, more from the fact of the quality of each of these items. It wasn't so much that I bought a stack of items, it wasn't the purchase price of the items that made it so good. It was just how quickly these items are gonna go on to sell because they are just very much in demand items. Some obviously super rare as well. And to find three pairs of Nike Dunks, that's gotta go down as an all time Hall of Fame thrift run or flea market run, I should say. Um, let's go into each and every one of these categories. We're gonna kick things off with the Dunks and I'm gonna show you what I think I can get for it. All right, the first shoe that we've got is the Golden Rod. Now I reckon we can get about $180 for these. They're a fairly common shoe. They're pretty standard from a colorway perspective, but 180 bucks being in brand new condition as well. Um, to pay $50 for that is just silly. Um, this one is probably the most expensive of all of them. Um, just this colorway, it's also a zero carbon waste um, you know, addition as well. Move to zero, Nike's journey towards zero carbon and zero waste. Um, these have sold for upwards of $250 to $300, this colorway, and obviously being brand new um, in its original box. A really good size as well, which is obviously so important. A US 11, uh, I'm gonna go for $300 on this shoe. Uh, and then this one here, there was only one comp on eBay for it. Um, this one here was a, a comp of $105. Being, being brand new in box, I'm actually gonna go for about 180, like the golden rods. Um, so golden rods and these say total of $360 worth of value there. And then the, uh, the zero waste, I'm gonna go with 300. So $660 worth of brand new dunks um, picked up at the car boot sale for $150. That alone, just truly blows my mind and makes me very excited about going out to the flea market on a Sunday morning. Next up was this one here. We've got the Fleer Ultra Skeleton Warriors cards that I spoke of quite a bit out there. Um, I don't know what these are, to be honest with you. It's got 1995, it's brand new and sealed on the back. This could be worth anything. Um, it does seem to be a complete set. It, what's, it's what they would have tried to sell back in the day in retail stores. They would have ripped this open, opened the lid, and then just uh, sold the packs off individually. I know these action figures, Skeleton Warriors, can go for some really good money, so I'm assuming the cards are gonna be very much the same. Really frustrating to not be able to get this one priced out um, by the guys at the Red uh, Toy Shop, um, Big Red Shed. That would have been nice to know a bit of value on this and maybe even a, a, a trading um, possibility as well. But that for thirty dollars, um, I, I can't wait to do some research into that and just see how much the estimated value is. Speaking to a few of the guys at the flea market about it, I'm anticipating anything about one hundred and fifty dollars. So we'll go with one hundred and fifty. Thirty into into one fifty is really really good. Um, this was the next one. This is just the Pokemon Funko Pop that I saw. Twenty five year anniversary. Just a retail price twenty to twenty five dollars on that, but I only paid two dollars. Um, so that's going to sell really quick. Being Pokemon, uh, and to only pay two dollars, you can't really go wrong. Um, the next is all of the video games. Now, I did a, I had a really good deal there. It was 10 video games that I ended up going with. These are the best of the bunch. Um, Ratchet & Clank is a $30 game, so that was really cool to have that one there. Uh, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4 on the black label. We'll get about $40 for that one. Um, Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3, I think that was about a $40 game as well from memory. Resident Evil Outbreak is a $40 game, so that was awesome. But then the best of the bunch, Dragon Ball Z, complete with manual, Budokai Tenkachi 3. Um, there are sales upwards of $200 for this game. Um, there are also sales down as low as $50 as well. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for about $150 worth of value. Um, so the other five best, these ones here are gonna be kind of money back scenarios. I paid $100 for 10 games, so I'm pretty much 10 bucks each uh, into these. And to be honest with you, I think X-Men's worth about $20. Um, but then Jack 2 and Jack 3 are probably only worth $30 sold as a bundle. Uh, and then TAC and TAC, TAC Original and then TAC 2, they're, they're worth about $30 as a bundle as well. So what's that? $60, $80 there and I paid $50. So it's kind of going to be money back on that set of allocation. But all the profit in the video games is going to come from these ones here. So an awesome deal to do there. Uh, 10 games for $100 at $10 each with some really big boppers in there. 
Um, very happy with that purchase. And then finally, we just had all of the hats. The first hat that we saw there, the um, the Forex beer hat, that should go for about $40 to $50. They sell very, very well. So to pay five was just crazy. And then at, down at the, uh, the Flockorama, um, uh, event that was going on. We were able to get these four hats off a viewer of the channel as well. So thank you very much. Um, hopefully you guys can support all of those vendors that we checked out this morning. It'd be really cool to give them a follow on social, maybe shoot them a message, say that I sent you. Um, that'd be epic. But um, this Fremantle Dockers hat was a good one. They're all old school vintage hats. This IndyCar Gold Coast Australia hat I thought was absolutely, absolutely epic. Uh, and then a West Coast Eagles embroidered uh, junior mascot hat there as well. And then the Sydney Roosters, really cool embroidery on that one there. I had to say yes to that too. I just love selling my hats. Um, so that was five hats that we ended up um, buying for $35 in total. Um, but like I said, I think that Forex hat's gonna be pretty much money back. We should get the $35 back on that one alone uh, in profit after fees and post, which means that the, the hat purchase overall, these four hats are gonna be just profit. So that was it. There were 20 items that we bought today, $312, an average of $15 per item, but we've got huge, huge items that are selling for upwards of $300, like the Nike Dunks. Um, so it was just so much fun. Plus also too, we've got all of these stickers. Um, they threw in all of these stickers here as well, a bunch of NBA um, stickers, really. They're all actually NBA. Um, so to get them thrown in as well, I might have to do something with those. But what a day down at the flea market. I could have easily spent more money. Um, I had to kind of reel myself back in because I've got 20 listings here. It was $300 that I had to spend. Um, didn't really want to go and spend too much more than that, uh, but I easily could have. I, I left a lot on the table, as you would have seen from the video. Um, if you enjoyed it, remember to subscribe to the channel. We, um, we do these videos every single week and uh, it'd be great to get you on board the journey. We're very close now to 20,000 subscribers. Uh, I'll leave you with another flea market video that we had, which is this video right here. So go click on that. Appreciate your support. We'll see you soon.